Today we focus on the crown of 12 stars on Mary's head. When did you last look at the stars? Away from city lights. The stars are the brightest signs in the night sky. Stars represent our dreams and our ideals. Our world often seems very dark. When we read about wars, poverty, the destruction of our natural environment, sometimes pollution stops us from seeing the stars. We also sometimes fall into despair that we cannot find that guiding star, that plan God has for our life. Our Blessed Mother was so in tune with God that she recognized his plan for her life at the Annunciation. Father Kentnich says, On her head she bears a diadem of stars. These are the stars of the virtues, the theological virtues and the moral virtues. She always took her bearings from the stars. We too should be people of the stars. We should have ideals, radiant, glorious ideals. In Schoenstatt, we often speak about a personal ideal. It is the journey of discovery to find the unique plan that God has for our lives. It is never too late to start. We can begin by meditating on where God has been present in our lives and recognize the gifts and talents He has given us. The good and bad experiences of our lives can also help us to discover where God is calling us to. To minister to the marginalized, to fight for environmental and economic justice, to be the heart of our family who always makes time to welcome those who enter our home. We cultivate that ideal by living in accordance with the virtues of courage, justice, honesty, compassion, temperance and kindness. Let us pray. Mary, my mother, the ocean star, walk with me as I discover and live out the vocation to which the Heavenly Father has called me. Open my heart so that I can see the events of my life in the light of faith and give me the courage to answer God's call to be a small, star-giving light to a corner of this world. Amen. Thank you.